Manjaro Linux is getting a brand new installer called Calamare. We're going to have a look at that installer right now on Spatry's Cup of Linux. Let's begin. First, we're going to start out with uh, dem the, the Calamari demonstration on Manjaro. It automatically detected my language, and now we'll select my time zone. I like how easy it is to press things on this. It's more improved. Okay, and then it automatically detected my keyboard layout for me, as you can see here. Okay, it's going to give me analysis of what needs to be done for the installation, and then we get into the partitioner. Now, this is something you guys wanted in the next release of MCOL. You want to be able to have a little bar you can slide. Let me show you this real quick. We'll uh, go ahead and select this one to install Minhoro alongside of MCOL. All right, and uh, let's go ahead and press next here. All right, now you'll see we have some sliders that you can slide uh, back and forth. Uh, so that you can, you know, shrink and grow a partition, it's much like you could on an Ubuntu installer. This has been on a number of you guys' wish lists, so now uh, this functionality is available. Pretty neat, huh? All right, I'm going to go back here, and rather, I'm just going to go ahead and just erase the disk and just install the operating system here, because I only have, as you can see here, a 20 gig hard drive. So, uh, you know, it's not practical for me to uh, dual boot, especially in VMware, uh, on a drive this small. Go ahead and press Next. And then, of course, we just fill in all of our user information. And once that is done, that is all there is to it. So this is the new Calamari installer uh, as we see it appear on Manjaro Linux. And uh, this also gives you the option to do uh, an administrator password account and that sort of thing. The only thing that this is missing is this does not have a slideshow. Let's move on to the uh, Chaos Installer. All right, and here we are in the uh, Chaos uh, Calamari Installer. By the way, uh, Chaos is not aff affiliated with uh, Manjaro at all. Uh, I want to point out that this automatically detected uh, my language, my time zone this time, keyboard layout, and all of my preferences. Uh, this time I started out with a fresh hard drive, so we're just going to go ahead and select to erase the disk and install Chaos. And there, of course, is my 20 gig hard drive again. Okay, we'll just go ahead and import all of our user data as we did before and then the installation process will proceed. Now, um, basically, I just wanted to get this video together so that I could show you guys uh, basically what installer is going to be coming on the next release of Manjaro. But there are other projects that are actually using Calamari, and this looks like a pretty nice uh, universal installer uh, that they have available now. Uh, the developer of uh, Chaos, and I believe that that I believe it's pronounced Chaos. And somebody, please correct me if I'm wrong uh, on that one, because I just have an, an affinity for pronouncing everything wrong. It seems these days, uh, but uh, it is what it is. At any rate, the developer of uh, Chaos uh, used to actually work with uh, Phil Mueller. Uh, on the Chakra project. So that's where the similarities uh, there were, and that's a reason why you're not seeing me on the screen, because when I initially filmed the video, I was in front of my green screen, and I had a different dialogue, and so I, I had a misunderstanding. I thought Chaos was part of the, of the Manjaro project, and in all actuality, it isn't. So, all right, I'm going to go ahead and fast forward ahead on the installer, and then... Uh, once the installation is complete, we'll uh, go ahead and close and then reboot the computer. All right, now after having 
Uh, seeing that the installer works beautifully, I had a chance to play around with KDE 5. I'm really liking how this looks, but uh, I still need to get used to it. Um, for some reason, it seems to misbehave a little bit in uh, in uh, VMware, and I haven't had a chance to try K uh, you know uh, KDE 5 uh, in uh, VirtualBox, so I'll probably get around to that uh, next time. But uh, at any rate, it looks like. Calamari is off to a great start. Uh, it is an easier looking installer. I didn't see any advanced features, but that is to be expected, considering that this is a uh, new release, and I'm sure more information will be revealed in the near future, because I do remember when we uh, got Dust, uh, you know, to get the advanced features, you had to issue a command line switch. I don't remember what that was at the time, but... Um, this looks like a really good improvement, so I can't wait to see what the next uh, release of Manjaro is going to bring to the table with the uh, new Calamari install. Well, that's all I have on this. Now, my next video is going to be my Christmas special, and believe me, I have a really cool surprise for you guys, so you'll definitely want to stick around for that one. We'll see you then.